what is what is there to say about that performance today? Um, well, pretty speechless to be honest with you. Um, you know, we just decide at the moment that's um, far beyond the pace that we want to be at. Um, and it's a massive eye-opener as to where we need to be as a team and our younger players need to be in terms of their skills um, at this level. Uh, so, hugely disappointed, but um, onwards and upwards, we're going to try and you know, keep our chins up and, and get a couple more wins out of these next three games. Do you think the side has, has done itself justice, given the number of absentees because of injury and, and the hundred and so on? Uh, or, or do you feel that you've seriously underperformed, even given the hand you've got? I think I think we've been really good up to this point, uh, to be honest. I think you know we've lost ten players to the hundred, and we're playing against teams who've lost one player or two players. Um, so we're basically playing our second team against everyone's first team, and to compete like we have in the past few games, not so much this game, but the two games before this to, to go and put a 300 plus on the board and, and put in a performance where we put ourselves in positions to win games of cricket we can't turn around and 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 say we've underperformed yes today you know we have underperformed um, but it's going to happen with a group of young players we're going to get it wrong at times um, but like I said moving forward in this competition we just need to keep our heads up and try and try and get a, one or two more wins it must be very demoralising, though, for the, for the younger bowlers to be going around the park in the way they did today. Well, if you want to play at this level, you have to, you have to sometimes learn the hard way. Um, you know, being thrown in the deep end sometimes doesn't look great, but it builds a lot of character and it creates experience. And, you know, these younger players in this position will, will find ways to come out the other side. That's what's really important about it so yes in the short term doesn't look great but long term you know it builds character and hopefully they come out the other side it must hurt particularly to go down so heavily to to the noisy neighbors of Gloucestershire yeah it always always hurts losing never mind losing by 200 runs um, but yeah I mean they're a good side they're a very good side you know they've got all their first team players by one or two very good bowling unit, very good batting unit um, so you know we can go back and reflect um, and reflect we'll do but uh, right now it's just a case of us keeping our heads up. How are you going to pick the players up after this for the trip up to uh, well, Northumberland to play Durham in, in Gosford on Thursday? Um, yeah I, I think you know we've got two or three days off before we travel um, feet up rest um, probably have a training day there uh, try and nail our skills um, and just try and push up north with, with as much confidence as we can, um, knowing that we got it wrong today, but you know, we need us a day out and, and, and we'll be back on our feet. Any chance that uh, Josh Davey will come back into the side be fit enough to do that? Unfortunately, I can't comment on that, not because I'm not allowed, but because I have no idea. Um, so hopefully he's going to have a scan or, or, or be assessed tomorrow to see how it pulls up. And hopefully he comes out um, uh, with nothing too serious and can, can come play for us next Thursday. Three games left. How realistic is it to, uh, to look for three wins to close off the campaign? I'll be happy with two. I'll be happy with two out of three. Um, whether it be the next game or the game after or the game after. I think, um, you know, we don't want to set our bar too high right now. Uh, we want to win the competition from the start. We've obviously put ourselves in a difficult position to do that now. But really, we need to take some confidence forward. Um, just moving into next year's campaign with the younger players that we have. So if they can just get as, as much confidence and as much experience as they possibly can with a few wins under their belts, I'll be very happy.